true. So sorry for late stream. Have a Father's Day baseball game event that my church was hosting. So my son and I went to that and it did run just a little late, but we are here. We're still streaming. It is going to be late, might be a little short, but I'm not letting you down. I'm never going to miss a stream, all right? Hey, Black Belt, what's up, buddy? All right, so let's continue along with Hogwarts Legacy. When we last left off, we had just finished the way. side quest for Arn. Still don't have my carts. Oh. So we have to talk to him again. On, I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was. Yeah, sorry about that, Black Belt. The baseball game did run a little late tonight. So. It was a very good game, though. Me and my son had a blast. I managed to free your and, uh, It was his first I'm professional baseball game. Oh, I can't wait to have my things and it was actually the first <gasps> professional baseball game that I was attending. And the team that I was rooting for actually won. And it was the first professional baseball game I was actually able to watch from start to finish. So it was fantastic. It was action packed. We had a great time. What's a nice idea? I think, uh, I wish you luck with it. believe it or not, I think my four-year-old was more excited about uh, the fact that he got to ride that. on a school bus that the church uses instead of the baseball game itself. He saw that bus and he lost his little mind, but he still had a great time. And... I just I just had to learn how out of shape I was, unfortunately. I did I did learn how out of shape I was. I had to I had to go up a few ramps, and I'll tell you what, it was not fun. Okay, so we're gonna go attend potions class. Maybe, maybe we'll get to, we can actually go to the, we're going to go to Library Annex here. Go to this flu flame. If I can remember, there we go. I'm trying to remember all these controls from all these different video games. The downside of being a variety streamer. You have so many... Um, so many controls you got to remember and keep separate. And then we do have some big news Thursday. Um, we will be getting the trial pack from Dubby, which is one of the energy drink, newer energy drink companies that I partnered with. So I will be doing an unboxing video as well as an honest review of their um, an honest review of their flavors so the trial pack that I got came with two little taste packets basically one serving each I got one for me obviously and then one for my fiance and she's gonna try it with me so I will be sure to let all of you know if it is good. I'm obviously not going to try and push something that I myself will not buy. Uh, you see my controllers. No, I did not. Did you post them in Discord? Let me take a look here. Oh, wow. Um, you know, Black Belt, there have been, there's many addictions in the world, and sir, I, I think you have a controller addiction. <laughs> that's, that's a lot. 
But those are some pretty cool controllers for sure. Is that the same? No, it's not the same. So my fiance actually had one from uh, Walmart that was kind of like that Afterglow one, but it it's not Afterglow. It's the cheap Walmart brand. And uh, it lasted her. Babe, how long did that controller from Walmart last you? Dang, one more on Wednesday. Share that wealth. What are you doing? I need like 12 controllers. I'm just kidding. Can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wiganweld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before yeah, actually, uh, completed, each of you will have I miss my wired controller. Of your own. I had the RGB lights around the border of the controller and around the buttons and everything. It was actually really nice. I can still play with it. I just can't use a headset with it because that port is malfunctioning. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Oh, your PS4. I forgot about that. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your. Yeah, I'm probably. sneeze could be disastrous. Gonna try to save up and get um, Modern Warfare 2 on my PS4 because I unfortunately definitely cannot afford a PS5 as much as I would like one for streaming purposes but it is on the list but for now I'll have to deal with the probably get the uh, cross-gen bundle and that way, when I do upgrade to a PS5, it's, you know, ready to go. But I, uh, I definitely do not like not being able to have the voice chat from game chat in Modern Warfare 2 not come through stream. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. Oh, heck yeah, that's awesome, man. Yeah, unfortunately, I have um, a few other priorities that I want to get first before I move to the PS5. It's up there on the priorities list, but I want to get... Um, I want to at least get a separate computer for the editing, because this computer that I use now, I have a double with... Uh, with um, work as well as streaming and you know having my stream up and running and then uh, all the editing so it's getting real slow and it's getting hard to use so I do want to get primarily a laptop kind of cheap for now I don't need to do the whole capture card stuff right away I'm Gareth, but I definitely want to get that Weasley, so that I can, with potions, you know, I so work on my on my content for the YouTube Wait, channel. Not having to worry about it being Weasley. too slow She's to upload or whatever. Because I'll tell you what, there was one day I should have had one video trying to upload on YouTube for two days. And on the second day, it was only at like 32 percent, and I was like, "There's no way this is right." So, of course, I had to do a hard reset on the laptop, and then it was just fine. Because it was, it was weird, because it was like a two-hour video. I think it was actually the last week's... Uh, um, last week's Hogwarts video. It was like two hours long, and I'm like, I just uploaded a video that's four hours long, like, last night, and it only took like 30 minutes. Like, how is this taking... Wait or, you, you know, two nights ready. prior, and it was only 30 minutes. How is this taking two days? It's only at 32%. That's not right. So. But. Yeah, it it gets the job done for now. Um, and that's, ultimately, that's, that's what I need. But I do want to upgrade, you know, have one computer... One laptop that I use for um, 
the editing process. Here's the flopper feather you wanted. And then eventually I would like Thank to you. get this is going to take a moment to brew. You should um, get back to brewing your endurance potion. Eventually I I, I, I do want to get finished. an upgraded laptop with a capture card. Oh man, that would be horrid. Efficiency and potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Yeah, no, I I definitely understand how that how that goes. That's I can imagine, but yeah. So then eventually I'm gonna get a better computer, better PC. It'll have to be laptop because can't afford a desktop computer. Well, not that I can't afford when I get it. I would be able to afford it, obviously, but I don't have room for it. Is what I'm trying to say. Getting ahead of myself. Um. But yeah, I want to get a like a real, a somewhat nice gaming PC or something, and you know that way then I can look into you know streaming some PC games that I've been wanting to do, like uh, um, there's that I think it's Phasmophobia where it's like the ghost hunting one. I think that one will be really fun. And that's one that I would like to try, so. Get it! Not again! But yeah, and then I'll use that gaming PC with the capture card for streaming from Xbox, PlayStation, all that all that jazz. I was impressed that you were able to answer Professor Sharp's question about the Wicked Meld potion. Oh! You're the new student. I've heard much about you. Um, thank you. I'm Amit, by the way. Uh, pleasure, truly. And I've never seen anyone yeah. bring such a flawless Wiganweld potion on their first I mean, drive. your setup looks pretty well, good, Black Bolt. It really does. I'm glad I was able to get it right the first time. You must simply have um, a knack And then eventually, of course, we're, some we're doing some... We're going to be doing some rearranging in our bedroom. Fascinating language uh, getting rid of a couple of things, so that'll kind of open up the room a little bit. So maybe I can get a desk and um, and I'll actually have space for everything. But yeah, Professor Shaw is firm but quite clever. You know, it's it's things it's things to come. So right now my main goal is to get you know a cheap but decent laptop that I can just use for. Um, editing purposes and then a uh, external hard drive as well I'm surprised you had the time you seemed rather busy helping this mm, yeah. chaos Not to. I'm sorry, Professor. I was merely trying to help a friend. Taking responsibility for one's actions does go a long way with me. I shall assume that you've learned a lesson. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you I have do to well redo to it that again, you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having well, a solid hopefully you won't have to completely rearrange things. You should gain an understanding it's just adding a PS5 of maybe you can just... Pay particular attention in her body. You know, the plants you nurture there probably just do away with your PS4 and boom, there it is. Here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. <sighs> what, what am I supposed I think to do? Each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Oh, class is dismissed. I want to do more class.
and oh okay well let's let's go learn Expelliarmus oh. Scrope knows about the old book you found from Professor Fink Scrope can help you That's the last time and I you have a potion can idea help Scrope get to the courtyard past the pendulum if you don't know it you'll see it easy enough and don't tell anyone what you're up to especially Professor Blink <laughs> Oh okay. Yeah, hopefully recabling isn't it isn't gonna be too difficult for you. So I definitely know how frustrating it is to have to rearrange stuff. It is not fun. Here's everyone in their school robes, and then here I am, in robes of the dark arts. It's I fine. Don't worry about it. I hope you take care of everything I had asked, Professor. I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spell casting requires a focused mind. And well, that's good. I hope it's not too bad. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Expelliarmus, you seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Expelliarmus. Still at it, I see. Levioso. Lumos. Alright. Go ahead and take a look at our collections we have unlocked now. Oh, the Goblin Made Helmet. of quests. So we could go do that right now, or we could see if we can find a couple side quests to do. There's got to be more side quests around here, but I guess it's not. 
Time to fish. You must be playing Stardew Valley right now. Revelio. That was a weird shadow. I guess not really. Let's go talk to Scrope and then go ahead and get that started. We'll see what side quests we can pick up while we're doing this one here. Scrope knows about the book you found. Is it missing something? Scrope does not believe it is safe to speak out in the open. Scrope has left another note across the bridge among the circle of rocks. Take care. Tell no one about this. Who is Scrope? Almost there, head for the pumpkin just down from the stone circle. Look inside one of them. You may be able to help poor broken hearted scrubs. Ah, I think I know just the place. Young Slytherin must be exceptionally curious by now. Meet Scrub at the water's edge by the broken Down dogs. to the water's edge? Hmm. This had better not be a trick. Oh, 
Merlin trial. What do you have in store for me this time? This the first time. I think I used Levioso. Levioso. Nope. Expelliarmus. Accio. Oh, it's that's why it's stuck. I wish it wasn't stuck. Akio. Come on. not want to move and I don't know why. It's like it's just glitched. It's glitched in place and I don't like it. Levioso! Expelliarmus! Incendio! Wants to be stuck right now. Akio. Come on. Hey, there we go. Not so tricky 
after all, Merlin. trial down. Thank you for coming all this way. The name's Scrope. Scrope serves the headmaster. I've been in the Black family for years. Apologies for the abundance of notes. Scrope wanted to be sure you weren't followed. What's this all about? Your notes mentioned the book I found in the restricted section. Scrope can tell you more in exchange for your help, but no one, especially the headmaster, can know. Happy to help, especially if you can shed light on the book. Scrope is grateful. Scrope's late mistress, Apollonia Black, May she rest in peace. Was a student at Hogwarts uh, over 50 years ago. Before she died, she spoke with passion of pages ripped from a book. Scrope suspects she took them to her private grotto. She was delirious at the end, poor thing. Mistook Belladonna for elderberries. <laughs> Scrope and then just tried so everyone is aware, probably that. only stream for Scrope, about another 30 minutes benefit if I find the pages there's a here a treasured black family I want to at least make sure there was a stream today Scrope wishes to give it to the headmaster Apollonia forbade Scrope from entering the grotto long ago Scrope continues to honor her wishes Scrope would not dare ask a student for help but when Scrope learned you were looking for those pages Scrope thought you might also find the ring How did you know that I'd found a book and that it's missing pages? Scrope and the other house elves are good at staying out of sight. Scrope hears and sees many things in the castle. Scrope knows how to keep secrets. Tell me more about this treasured ring. Oh, it's adorned with the Black Family Crest. The headmaster would be pleased with Scrope for returning it. How did you injure your ear? The Blacks have a tradition of decapitating their house elves when their service is no longer required. One day, dear Apollonia was understandably frustrated with Scrope and got a bit too eager with a cleaver. Scrope was able to convince the sweet girl of his value and now views this small injury as a reminder of her good heart. It seems this may help us both. Um, I shall do it. Scrope is relieved. Scrope hoped the young Slytherin would be willing to help. Take this toast to the grotto just down the coast and place it on the pedestal there. Good luck. Scrope will wait right here. For All me. right. Best of luck finding your pages. And the ring.
Why would I need a piece of toast? I suppose that's where it goes. Richard Jackdaw. I was a student, just like you, about a century ago. How in the world did you find this place? A house elf named Scrope sent me. Said I might find a black family ring here. Ah. Sorry to say I sold the ring a long time ago. Poor Scrope. Still holds a candle for Apollonia, I reckon. Can't say I blame him. I stole all these treasures just to impress her. Alas, it was to no avail. I thought a secret map I pilfered from Peeves would pique her interest. But she simply rolled her eyes. What would I want with yellowed old pages torn from a book? Not my finest moment. I'd like to have those pages, if you don't mind. They're not here. I thought if Apollonia wasn't interested in the map on the pages, perhaps it would lead to something that would intrigue her. So, I followed the map. To what I can only describe as an enchanted cave of some kind. And you see what happens next. Here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest, and I'll show you where to find the pages. I think I could guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look around when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After that, I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for, specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Why did I need the toast to get in here? Oh, that was Apollonia's idea. Seems some squids love toast. They should have taught you that at Hogwarts. How is it possible to steal from Peeves, a poltergeist? I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. He has a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor, whatever's sure to cause the most chaos. He dropped them after a particularly aggressive romp through the library. I suppose if that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you at the forest. I'm sure the pages are still tucked in my waistcoat. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, they're yours for the taking. All right. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Hello, Scrope. Thanks to you, I was able to enter Apollonia's grotto. The toast was the key. I met a ghost there, Richard Jackdaw, who's agreed to lead me to the pages I've been looking for. Oh, that boy was never good enough for Apollonia. Oh, what of the Black Family Ring? I'm sorry to say that Jackdaw sold it long ago. Sad news indeed. Scrope shall need to think of another way to impress the headmaster. Well, 
Scrope takes some consolation in knowing that the young Slytherin found what they needed. I did. Thank you again, Scrope. You're a credit to house elves. Nice to see you, my young friend. Here's Apollonia, which you care to join me for a picnic. I know you enjoy good Cornish pastry as much as you enjoy good mystery. See you soon. I hope yours, Richard. The candles seem to be leading into the Forbidden Forest. Treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic in the Forbidden Forest. Treasure hunting suits me. stately in its time. That's not creepy at all. Here I am, as good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It took the cunning of a Slytherin to track down these pages. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. 
I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know... The closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Nothing to do now but keep going. Solomon about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. There it is. Just as Jackdaw described. Intramuros. eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. Protego! Stick to that! Oh. Huh? Oh. No! I will make Let me you so. Back here! will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Doris led me. I wonder how big this place is. Akio! Incendio! Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. Spells. Lumos. Protego. Stupid. Expel 
Expelliarmus. Levioso, expel the armor, potato, stupid. Akio, another puzzle. But if Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. Expel the armor. and one. The next symbol is hidden somewhere. I wonder if I can move that platform somehow. Oh, there's something I'm missing here. Just don't know what. That is what is infuriating.
That is not it. Hudson, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. I hope you are enjoying your night. for the night here. Make sure I can save. Maybe. There we go. Alright, so I'm going to have to shut down stream for tonight. I was hoping to stream for longer, however, I am exhausted beyond exhausted so we'll see you all tomorrow tomorrow is going to be our next installment of witcher and or no tomorrow is not going to be our next installment of witcher uh tomorrow is going to be multiplayer so we'll be doing some call of duty and then we will be setting up a minecraft server and I do believe it will be Black Belt and Sonic with me. So be sure to tune in. That will be fun. And I am also hopefully going to be able to do a few Warzone matches with the original, the other three of the original four of Task Force GSO. Just the way we used to do it. So we're going to kick it a little old school and just do the OG4. But it should be a fun night with lots of fun times. So with that being said, I hope everyone has a terrific rest of the night. And I will see you tomorrow. Good night, everyone.